When you're a hooper, you don't really, the weight room is the last place you want to be. It's like you, it's like that's the last place. That's, that was like foreign. For like, basketball players? What? Mm -hmm. What? I didn't, I didn't, no, don't. You, they're fine. You, they're fine in me. We had, we had to like work out days. Like, no, I don't, no, I want to get shots up. I don't care nothing about, I ain't trying to Listen. arm wrestle nobody. Right. Like, you know, like the wall. But just you didn't understand the benefits to you at that time, like, all you wanted to do, you just, you're a hooper. Yeah, I just wanted to hoop. Like, the, like being strong, it seemed like my brain always said, well, if I'm strong. Then it's going to mess up your shot. Or no, it just, it, then it looks like I don't get fouled because I'm running through everybody. <laughs> LeBron's never actually led the NBA in free throw attempts for a guy who drives all the time. You, you, you yeah, see what sure. I mean? Yeah. You know, for a guy who drives all the time, all this contact right, yeah. he receives, and he doesn't lead the league in free throw attempts is because what ends up happening is human nature. You're strong enough to take it. Mm -hmm. He just, <laughs> you know what I mean? So when he drives, the ref's like, well, you, you should make that. He bounced off you. Yeah, you know, and that's, and that's where I learned early, like, uh, the strongest penalized. Right, yeah, you it's, the we, it's the weak, <laughs> the ones who look weak that gets all those calls. Right, right, right. <laughs> you know, the Allen, you know, the Allen Iverson, you know, trying mm -hmm. to guard him. You know, you know, right. that's what I said. You know, Allen, if he was 160, I would give him credit. But, you know, as soon as you touched him, you know, he was so little. Wow. Body frail. Like, yeah. Just, yeah, just as soon as you, as soon as you try to put anything on him, right. he, he knew how to use it and one. Like, God. I, I the it's just the laws of physics. You know, just the laws of physics. foul on that right there. <laughs> but he still would go after the bigs. Yeah, no, because he, he knew any contact, he was flying. Yeah, he yeah. was. He was. So yeah. saying that's why he. Yeah. yeah. And so he knows I'm just gonna headhunt it. He just so we, we become headhunters. Yeah. I know as soon as I run into him, boom, it's gonna be it's gonna be a quick foul. Right. right. And then just optics. Mm -hmm. Just from the <laughs> optics. optics. <laughs> you know what I mean? Like big guy, little guy. <laughs> How did he get way over here? You know what I mean? <laughs> <laughs> so I'm, that's what I associate right, right. being strong with. Like, I don't need to be strong because it's a disadvantage because now right. I'm going to be trying to bully through people. And then when, when Earl Boykins came, oh, I never wanted to go in the weight room. He little. He in here killing. So there ain't no point. <laughs> ain't no point in me going in there lifting all but, these weights. Earl Boykin, he was oh, like he was, pound. He, he was yoked, bro. That's exactly. <laughs> exactly. You know I'm saying? He was like, for the, his side, like pound for pound. Yeah. He has little arms. Yeah. So he has little arms, so you don't see this massive <laughs> chest. So what ends up happening one day, I'm like, oh, Earl, I've never seen Earl lift, so shh, good, we good. I don't need to go in there. Nah, no, I'm with Earl. And then Earl came in one day, put the two plates, boop, 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 boop. Huh, huh, huh. Oh, <laughs> no. <nah. laughs>